monkeypox has been detected in the wastewater of Northern California, suggesting that there's more transmission than meets the eye. And I think uh, what we're seeing now in cases is really the tip of the iceberg. That warning comes from Dr. Peter Chin Hong, an infectious disease specialist at UCSF. He says the higher rates of transmission are being met with slow response and not enough vaccines. The FDA recommends two doses of the monkeypox vaccine to be most effective. But because of the lack of supply, Dr. Chin Hong says the new strategy is to administer just one dose. There is actually some uh, laboratory data suggesting that one dose can actually have up to two years of protection. I hope it doesn't spread more broadly, but it definitely could. And if it does, and then we see a much broader swath of the population seeking vaccines, that will quickly swamp the system. California State Senator Scott Weiner, who represents San Francisco, is concerned that like other infectious disease outbreaks, monkeypox could become endemic. He's calling for emergency funding from the state to provide funding to local counties, especially for more testing. Weiner says Governor Gavin Newsom addressed monkeypox with the White House during his recent trip to D.C. and that other senior state health officials have held high-level talks with their federal counterparts. We're all putting a lot of pressure on our federal partners because they're the ones best positioned to turn this around on vaccinations. I do believe they now have a much greater sense of urgency. Currently, there's only one lab that manufactures the monkeypox vaccine in the world, but Wiener says they've agreed to license it. He adds it's up to the Biden administration to pressure U.S. manufacturers to step up. We've been trying to light a fire to say that you need to do everything humanly possible to accelerate and expand the production of these vaccines, making sure that other manufacturers are stepping in, providing financial incentives. Even if U.S. companies do so, extra vaccines are still months away. In San Francisco, Ansar Hassan, ABC7 News.